How's it going, everybody? Welcome back. So just a quick video to address double VPN and uh, just want to explain a few things, everything you need to know about this feature. Uh, now, here you have with NordVPN, you've got this feature. So if I go ahead and select, for example, the Netherlands uh, and go to servers, you'll notice that we have the Netherlands with a bunch of other countries. So <clears throat> what it means is that this is an advanced VPN security feature that routes your traffic through two VPN servers instead of just one, encrypting your data twice. Now with double VPN, your online activity hides behind two servers instead of one, which is known as VPN server chaining or multi-hop or double VPN. And the basic principle is very simple. Your traffic is first encrypted on your device and redirected to a remote VPN server. So when I go ahead and let's say choose, I don't know, Netherlands, Sweden, if I go ahead and connect, I will be connected to these two servers at once. So it reaches the server and gets re-encrypted and the encrypted traffic then passes through a second VPN server where it gets decrypted. You reach your internet destination securely and privately using two IP addresses, two servers and double the encryption, making it unbelievably difficult to identify your location, your real IP address. I mean, a single server without double VPN is already enough, but when you're using double VPN, it makes it that much more difficult to identify um, and, and uh, you know, kind of reach or intercept your connection or whatever. And using the Nordlinks protocol, uh, it's going to give you really good speeds because previously, and this was still on NordVPN, uh, when I used to use double VPN with NordVPN, it used to kind of cut my uh, speed in half. But now that they've optimized the Nordlinx protocol, it makes NordVPN arguably the fastest VPN in the industry. That's number one. Number two, it barely affects the speed, even when using double VPN, which is very impressive. I mean, you're using two servers at once and you still don't really lose out on it. Now, when to use double VPN? Well, if you're a journalist or a political activist and you want to make sure that your government or ISP uh, will never be able to identify you. Uh, this is one really good way of uh, utilizing double VPN, or if you just want to avoid government surveillance, or you need to protect your sources because you can never be too careful when working, for example, with whistleblowers, informants, and other vulnerable sources using double VPN, the double traffic encryption to make doubly sure that you can discuss sensitive topics in absolute privacy. Uh, so, yeah, it's a pretty useful feature, especially with NordVPN, since you don't really lose out on speed when using double VPN. It's just an extra security layer that you can add. Uh, so if you guys are interested in NordVPN, by the way, I'll leave links to pricing and discounts in the description down below if you'd like to jump straight to that. Either way, you have a 30-day money-back guarantee to stress test the service for 30 days risk-free. Uh, and of course, if you'd like to learn more about NordVPN's privacy policy, speed streaming, torrenting capabilities, as well as security and features, you'll find the full review in the description down below as well. Besides that, comment below if you have any questions, I'll be happy to answer all of them. Like and subscribe if you'd like to support the channel and stay up to date with everything VPN and cybersecurity. Thank you guys very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day.